Experts say some of the most dramatic warming we see from climate change is happening during Minnesota winters. Data from Climate Central shows part of Minnesota has warmed nearly six degrees since 1970. SWCCO's Aaron Hazanzada explains the change is impacting our 10,000 lakes. Survey has worked in um, Indonesia in Lake Matano trying to understand oceanographer Jay Austin is part of a group of scientists studying the largest lakes in the world. He's based here at the University of Minnesota Duluth. It's world class research. We'd like to think so, yeah. Um, and it's to our knowledge the only organization that has as their stated mission the Great Lakes of Earth. While Austin and his colleagues travel the world doing research, one of the biggest stories out there is right at their fingertips. Here on Lake Superior, one of the fastest warming lakes in the world. I think one of the most visible manifestations of climate change on Lake Superior is the decrease in winter ice. But ultimately what we're what that is all playing into are these warmer summers that we are reliably experiencing. Mm -hmm. It's and all interaction. It's all interaction and, and temperature is this sort of master control knob on how ecosystems work. Many experts are taking note of the changes here on Lake Superior because it holds 10% of the world's fresh surface water. So what happens here matters to a big community. Mm -hmm. From massive research vessels like the Blue Heron to smaller research floaties on some of Minnesota's smaller lakes, we're crossing the state to understand how all of our lakes are faring in a changing climate. If we decide to continue with um, business as usual, as they call some of the scenarios, um, then yeah, we're, we're headed rapidly towards um, a world where we don't see Iceland superior anymore. Aaron Hassanzada, WCCO News. You can catch Aaron's full story on our warming waters coming up today on the 4. That's right here on WCCO.